Hi there, I'm Vicki Parfano from Vicki Parfano Stamps and today I'm going to do an unboxing of the Project Life All-in-One Kit. Now those of you who know me know that my favourite size for scrapbooking is a smaller size, so Traveller's Notebook is my absolute favourite. My next favourite size is a 6x8 album. I like the smaller canvases, I think it's less intimidating just working with a smaller size. But I saw this at Creativation and I thought I'd like to have a look at what's inside of it and give you a heads up on what you can get in the all-in-one kit. Now, if you are getting into scrapbooking and you don't really want to go to all the expense of, you know, buying a huge album and then buying all the page inserts, then buying the journaling cards and what have you, then this could be a really good option for you. It is all-in-one. It cost me $55 Australian. I got it from Spotlight. And inside it has a 6x8 ring album, 156 Project Life cards, 26 photo pocket pages of two varieties, I do believe. And I'll just show you the back. So these are some of the cards that are inside it. It's a very bright colour. Um, it's probably not the colour I would have chosen myself. It has a nice pink spine on it, which is great. But you can see these are the elements that you get. There's your pocket pages and it says add your own photos. But there's your project life cards and your album. So let's get inside this baby and see what's in there. So it comes from American Crafts. It's put out by American Crafts and um, it is Becky Higgins Project Life. And I've been using Becky Higgins albums for a very long time now. And... This is the cover. Now it's got some um, cards on the front of it, so the cover actually looks like this. So I'll just cut the cellophane and see what's inside. Now I'm designing a lot of my own inserts and things that will fit into Project Life albums. So, you know, you'll see me um, bringing some of those onto this channel as well and showing you what I'm designing that are designed to go into the albums as I do my own layouts. But I'll be doing some regular Project Life layouts as well just to show you um, how to get the most out of what you have. So this is one of the pocket pages. This is one of the larger cards and the two smaller cards. It has a bit of sticky on the back of that, so I'm hoping that that's not going to cause a problem when I put it into the album. But the cards are double-sided, so you can see my favorite part of today, and it does coordinate nicely with the cover. It's the same designs. So inside, here are the cards. Now, I guess if you wanted to be all neat and tidy, you could keep that inside your album. I'm not going to though, I just like the look of my album being my album and I'll put them somewhere separate. So there's quite a few um, inserts, look at all the inserts you get. Now on the box I think it said 26 pages, I'll just double check for you, um, where are we? 26 photo pocket pages, that's very generous. So 26 pages means you're going to get a 52 page album really when you consider that you're going to be using the front and back of each of the pages and the configurations we have four squares I'll just get some colored paper here I'll use the craft paper you can see that a bit more easily you can see there's the four squares there and then there's a different lot of papers which is where you get the larger pieces below so I'll show you that you can see there's a large pocket and two smaller pockets and according to the box that's pretty much it but you know I'll get myself some plain ones so I can do some title pages maybe maybe I will maybe I could make one of these a title page I don't know but let's get into the cards and see what's happening with those the first thing I want to do is put this in the front so I don't lose it it's a spare I don't know if it's included as one of the 26. It does have a bit of sticky on the back, so I might get some nail polish remover and try and take that stickiness off. Okay, cards. Here we go. Whoa. So let's have a look at them. So I'll start with the large cards. And I'll get it in frame for you so you can see what's going on. 
so you'll see me um, journaling in my travels notebook you'll see me journaling in project life albums and I'll take you through my layouts as I do them and you can watch them here on this channel now here are some pretty oh, I like these these hearts are cute so let's have a look at the back so there's a few one two the same by the look of that one two three four okay four cards the same love this and it's nice having some cards the same throughout your album because as you're looking through it you're going to actually come to back to you know something that you recognize from an earlier page i like that so i'm assuming there's going to be four of these as well one oh one two three four yep four of each i think you are my bright side that's a saying i haven't heard before i like that and the weekend review they're always handy to do the weekend review cards if you think my hands are full you should see my heart oh again it's something i have not heard so there's a whole lot of sayings here that are new and i like that if you think my hands are full you should see my heart notes and date on the back so you can do lots of journaling on the back and it looks as though they're designed as you know journaling on the back and pictures on the front which makes sense this matches the cover a slightly smaller version i like that <clears throat> excuse me this is the best life yes indeed it is and one of the things i love about scrapbooking it, it does remind us to be grateful because there are so many things to be grateful for just in being alive oh the memories with some albums ah, i like that too i have a lot of albums sitting on my shelf so that's sweet note to self relax <laughs> good very cute and this is like the one that was on the front cover this one here so four of those and on the back some journaling this is the new oh no hang on let's say that again now is the new later now is the new later yeah i guess it's kind of talking about the future i suppose <laughs> and some socks well i like that it is very bright if you're not into bright colors you know you might not like this as much as i do i like bright colors and i like something that's a bit different than what i might normally pick myself because it stretches me as an artist to do a little bit of um you know changing the way i do stuff hey sugar there's a donut which i do like i love the colors of this it's quite retro that soft odinil green do all things with love yes that's indeed very true I just want to be where you are four of those and you'll notice these don't have rounded corners yay I much prefer my project life cards not to have rounded corners and I'm glad they're finally bringing them out without the rounded corners now if you don't like the rounded corners and you prefer these let me know in the comments below because I sure do I think it just looks really neat when you put a page together look, look at this there's no rounded bits it just makes sense somehow I don't know I just want to be where you are the cute little fox or it could, it could be a dog it looks a little bit more like a dog and a little clipboard for today and some journaling nice oh I could cuddle you forever that's cute okay nice colors this green I'm really being drawn to this green background with the white I do like it actually and weekend yeah it's important to have um, journaling for the weekend because that tends to be the day I do most things is on the weekend you know it's it's the most social day of the week generally although I do tend to do a lot of Friday lunches and Wednesday lunches with girlfriends um, and I have classes on Wednesdays every month so that I that I run in the studio here so you know my weeks are busy too but weekends tend to be when I do most things so that's sweet again it's picking up those colors on the front and when you actually look at the cards I'm actually liking this a whole lot more than when I first opened it I'm seeing what when I what I can do with it I really like it ah uh, right oh, messy bun and getting things done again this is really different sayings I didn't know I haven't heard that one before so it's a bad hair day I guess messy bun and getting things done yeah I can relate to that because I often uh, put my hair up in a clip at the back when I'm working around the house yeah I like it date journaling there oh this is sweet again more albums and yeah we're scrapbookers so we have a lot of these albums around I like that there's some albums on the journaling card itself very sweet bookshelves 
this week oh okay it's a little week monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday weekend i like that so you can just put in the highlight for each day yeah that makes journaling pretty simple hooray it's today <laughs> i really have to give um credit for the fact that i have not heard a lot of these sayings and they are cute you know some of the sayings that are going around at the moment with scrapbooking i love them but i sort of see them everywhere i'm just getting rid of my scissors out of the frame there okay hooray it's today there's a little cat there so and more journals again which i really really like okay best memory this week yeah so that's good too excuse my phone's just going off in the background there i'll get that later okay next there are the smaller size cards which go in the smaller pockets so and if you're forgetting the configuration the configuration is four equal size pockets like that so you've got four equal pockets or you've got this configuration here which is the larger pocket into a smaller one so that's what you've got to work with in the album I do believe you can get refills that are just blank pages and I think I'll probably be sourcing out those just because I do like doing big titles so the first lot of cards so let's see how many of each could be four again one two three four yep one two three four yep four of each circles and oh this is sweet uh it's just little sprinkles that you put on your cupcakes i like that or on baking yeah i like that uh i woke up like this <laughs> yeah so that's you know if you take a photo of yourself and it's not that glamorous that's a good one to go with that i like that backing piece too there's there's just a small journaling area sometimes that's what i want i don't want to have to fill in a whole card so that's good it's giving me options but project life is good like that you know the, you get different options for however you like to journal and however you like to document really pretty florals that's really soft and nice no rest for the rad uh -huh, another new saying i heart naps yes i certainly do i love to nap <laughs> what about you do you like taking naps there's a pencil on the bottom of this and a little tape note that's really cute i like that yeah and some more designs here and these are all different to the large cards which is nice now none of the large cards have the same designs on them i like that and to do list so you've got bullet points here and yeah i i like putting these in monthly so what to do this month so it's like my monthly goals rather than this is what i did this week although you could do that too if you like to do it that way today more pencils and journals yeah i love my journaling i do love my traveler's notebook love my bullet journal love my love today planner that i use and um yeah it's nice to have that in the cards here and just very basic journaling square on the back nice better together so this is quite vivid i think i'd like some black on that i can see myself doing some black stamping on that just to cut back the colors on it places to go things to see and there's a set of car keys with the little remote you know that you beep to get into your car i like that yeah i like that getting in the car going somewhere better together is good love ya xoxoxo oh my friend michelle always signs off love ya <laughs> so that's perfect <laughs> so there's a phone with love ya yeah like that indeed and there is uh, what you would call us i guess a soda on the back we would call that a soft drink or um you know <laughs> um what would we call that in australia maybe mineral flavored mineral water is what i would have i tend not to have um, soft drinks occasionally i'll have a can of coke with pizza but that's very very rare that i do that generally i prefer water or fruit juice yeah so that could be my fruit juice uh let me see what this is one two and three on the back it's a bit hard to see those they're they're really fine if i bring it up closer to the camera maybe you can see there's one two and three printed on there really pretty hearts going one way hearts going another way that's nice that's a really nice design 
every day I'll make up of how cool is this yeah every day when I leave the house I put makeup on so this is a big part of my day if I'm staying around the house I generally put moisturizer or sunscreen on and just leave it at that but yeah if I'm going out makeup is a big part of how I start my day a bit of nail polish there definitely need that when I'm making videos as you can see I do polish my nails before I make these videos for you yeah, but that's important, isn't it, to just, it, this is part of our daily routine. Uh, not everybody wears makeup. If you're one of those lucky ones that doesn't really need it, I'm very fair, so I like to, um, you know, put a bit of colour on. This is a soft pink, nice for journaling. Oh, this is sweet. These are some tiny little grey birds in flowers. Really nice. And on the back, it's little happy emojis. Five of them just happy just happy and here's another little gray bird and it says love again it's that nice green color that green color is probably my favorite color in the album I really like it and cups oh yeah well they're actually mugs so mugs one two three four five mugs piled up I love it when I have a lot of mugs piled up on my sink because it means I've had girlfriends over and we've had coffee together <laughs> or Paul and I have had cups of tea all day long that's nice I like that okay the good life and some glasses yeah I like glasses I wear glasses so I like to see them in albums <laughs> it's good the good life and on the back my weekend is all booked Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday ha huh. that's cute again that's something that you can just put in um, weekly there's four of them so that would you know you could maybe do like a every month do what you're doing that week or you could spread it out over four months whatever you want and the next lot of cards I'll just get into these these are some more three inch by four inch cards all right so we've got some green background on this with some daisies and on the other side it says so this happened great for journaling that one we've got an ampersand here with some flowers on it in a nice soft lilac and again quite a plain journaling card same design as that but different colorways here's some more kind of gal stuff which is uh, let's turn it up the right way handbag shoes makeup perfume uh, t-shirts yeah, kind of stuff that is about your wardrobe remember this and again those nice glasses that I like so worth it again the nice green color and who what where and when that's a great journaling prompt to have so yeah that's a good one it's kind of when you're stuck for journaling you can use those prompts they're really helpful I love these colors feel beautiful today and my favorite part of today on the back let's stay home yeah yeah often I just like to curl up with a book and a cup of coffee or a glass of wine lovely and some sunglasses on the back today was the best and noted and there's a fox that one's definitely a fox I think the other one I was showing you before was a puppy dog this one's a fox jeans t-shirt top knot yep that's me <laughs> heck yeah I like that ticket stub yeah I've just um, trimmed my hair a little bit it's it's much more difficult for me to get it into a top knot now because I've put some layers in it I don't know if that was a good move or not you know it'll take a while to grow back again more fun and tag and a to-do list with a checklist and again um, that could be a weekly one yeah I think that's more weekly eat dessert oh no hang on got to get this right it says life is short eat dessert first and there's that donut again I do like that life is short eat dessert first why not extra sprinkles cute and this one has a lot of books like uh, I'd say they're like novels so that's books that you would read thumbs up so so that's excellent too uh, purr and cuteness there's a kitty cat and on the back 
these are a few of my favorite things and another good journaling prompt because you know these things are fun to put in your album it's something that you might not necessarily think of if you don't have the prompt so i like prompts that give you those ideas happy heart that's the last one and some journaling on the background and i did want to also point out that this is called the oh my heart kit and it's designed by Paige Evans, even though it is uh, from the Becky Higgins Project Lifeline. So, Oh My Heart. So, they may have different ones. I don't know. This was the only one I could see at Spotlight. And that's the last card done. So, there's the box with the cards in. And that's the album. Well, for $55, I think that's really good value. Um, it would have cost me a lot more to buy the album separately and then buy 26 pages and then buy all the cards. So, yay. I like finding something that is a bargain as you know i'm a very frugal crafter i am not one for paying too much for my craft supplies i like things that help us keep our craft spending in check so this is good also to mention it has the little corners on the edge which are imperative with these albums otherwise they get knocked about it's matte finish but it, it has like a coating on it so it's going to last reasonably well i imagine and i also uh, forgot to mention that it's a two ring binder it doesn't have those little pieces on the end you're just pulling it apart and popping it together well my verdict is i really like this i'm definitely going to use it i like it a lot more now i've seen the cards inside it i, I didn't quite know what to expect from the cover but i really like it so yeah i think it's worth the money 55 dollars australian in spotlight stores Thanks for watching and I'll come back with some of my Project Life spreads and my Traveller's Notebook spreads as well in another video soon. Bye for now.